Hey everybody, welcome back to Elden Ring. Uh, we're looking to kind of clear out this tree, a couple of other sections in the south of Limgrave here. And uh, then, who knows what. But, there are some problems brewing at the little tree. And it looks like it's a, actually a pretty large problem. I don't know if this is a horse fight or... Try horse. <laughs> Perfect! We should be able to handle this. You would think. Uh-oh. Oh, he's getting stuck there. Okay, I got way too greedy there. I was thinking that was going to be no problem. Like, shouldn't have been one. But here we are, living the, living the embarrassed life. The problem here is all of the stuff we can get stuck on with the horse. If you could just go ahead and clear out all of these, that would be great. <laughs> Not like this. Whoa. Oh, wait, what? What did that say? Yes. It uses tears. Oh, no. That's the first time I've seen that, I think. Thank you. Okay, let's check some of these bad boys. Maybe gives us an opportunity to change our physic a bit. Uh, restores half of total HP. Steadily restores HP for a time. Stamina. Strength. Magic. Significantly negates damage. Oh, that would be kind of cool. Can be mixed in the flask under physics. Provides significant damage negation. However, the effect only occurs once. Will expire after a certain duration. Okay. I'm into that. I'm going to try that when we rest next. Hopefully. Is there anything else at the tree? Here's singing. Okay, nothing else at the tree. So that means now, let's get rid of that. Uh, we're gonna head out to, to three here. Do we have a road? What 
the hell? Not anymore. Singing is gone. I think these are the same type of bats that we saw in the... Like in those mines. If not mistaken, they were singing too. Just check this tip. <laughs> Not respecting him. Farmers have come to help. I don't think it's going to be enough. Turn. Ha! Huh. Hello. I didn't even notice you were doing anything. Ensnared in a transporter trap. Okay, somebody pointed this out to me really early on. I ran into some type of um, cave situation. There was like this smoky opening, and then I ran away from it. Oh, wow. And they were saying uh, we shouldn't have done that. This is cool, I think. <laughs> heck are we looking at? Oh, this see, this is nice to have a, a random spawn. Oh, look at this. Let's do um, this new physic here. We're going to go HP and the other one. Or damage reduction. Am I supposed to kill you? Not a great opener. Little two hand here. That ledge is going to be what do what does me in. Whoa, dude. Well, that might be a little teleporter thing at the end there. This is really risky. Blessed dew talisman. Really hard. Oh, not the ledge.
find a way back in. Protection bubble. And it's gone. Okay. be cool if he could run off. Oh, oh, I forgot about the rocks. Yeah, this might take a couple of goes here. I just do not want to fight him over there because we're going to get sucked into the auto target and then... What the... I think we could have got way more out of that. ran off the ledge. One of his long attacks could be a problem here. Go, go, go! Yes. Yes, very nice. I will take that. And then what? Critical hit. Cannot be used now. Is that right? Huh. I, for, I was like convinced that was going to activate. So why wouldn't it? I wonder. Huh, that is really weird. So, if we ever end up activating some type of portal somewhere somehow, then maybe... Oh, hold up. Okay, this isn't active either. Really weird. This just seems to be completely off on its own deal. All right. Huh. 
we'll check that talisman that we got. Blessed Dew slowly restores HP. Ooh. Let's see if this just works. At any threshold. Oh, this probably would have pointed to those catacombs, eh? We just stumbled on them. Yeah, I think once we're in there, these things don't show anything. All right. Oh, no. <sighs> Looks like we have another one of those, um... Maybe one of those Evergowl type things. want to go? Watch this teleport me back there, kill another giant. The winged scythe. I can't believe how many weapons there have been in this area. It's kind of insane. According to pagan belief, white winged maidens are said to be death gentle envoys. Angel wings. Jump and imbue the wing blade of the armament with light, then deliver a slashing attack on the enemy. That's cool. Needs a lot of faith. turtle okay i gotta i gotta keep it together here there's a lot of things we want to check out one at a time it is an ever goal be wary of frost i need a key for this it seems i don't even know how many we have that's probably the, the last one I wonder if that, <laughs> I'm calling them land turtles, if they work the same as the previous one that we'd run into, or the previous couple. I mean, that was pretty ballsy. Oh. There's the frost, okay. know what she was doing I don't know if she did either oh that 
probably would have finished her there. See ya! Bring on all the Evergals. Radagon's Scar Seal. Raises attributes? What's the butt? But also increases damage taken. Bigger endurance, strength, dexterity. I mean, it's raising them all by three. That is... Not that bad. Look at our little HP regen there. I mean, that's probably nice to have when you're out cruising on the horse. Let's increase the damage and see... We'll just see how it feels. Okay. Let's go to four. Headless. Fourth Church of America. Let me guess. Oh, there's even a site in here. Cave ahead. Let's throw this in right now. Okay, the last thing that we've got marked is this little swamp, which... All these headless dudes. So let's just seek down in this direction. <laughs> Guys, we are cruising. I'm so glad that we came back to this area because there's been a ton of neat stuff. Fusion ahead. Now it says no rolling. Uh, hold up. What if we did? Poison. Oh, shit. I mean, this works. I wish I could install an attachment for just, like, actual rapid fire.
Okay, I can't craft anymore. Oh, I still have one. Poison right. Okay, but what about... Oh, God. I mean, I guess I could just let it hit us, honestly. It's not that big of a deal. We can heal through it. As long as I don't forget. What did we gain in here? Oftentimes, there's a certain reward for clearing all of this. Oh, here we go. Hold up. <laughs> We're not done. I knew it was rat. I didn't know he'd be gigantic. Cookbook eight. Uh oh, that's not what I wanted to do. Poison grease and drawstring. Oh, that's actually so nice. Okay, that's worth it. That's worth it. I wish... I wish that I had, uh... Like, some poison... Immunity craftables. I don't seem to yet. Peace out. Pretty sure this is where we came in. Okay, 21,472. Let's crush. That'll do. Uh, you know what we're gonna do as well? We're gonna go... Let me put this into FP. Uh, we're gonna go do some upgrades once this area is clear. To our liking. We'll see about upgrading our sword. I'm sure we have enough. We're going to check out the bell turtle here.
Yeah, see, he's got that same stuff, so... It'll be interesting, because those other ones were, like, mausoleums. But... This guy having a, a bell... Maybe he's something different, or maybe he kind of gets us into understanding what those are. tell if he if we're making progress or like the previous ones we didn't have to destroy all of the growths I don't think cool. there we go we're making progress so he like sucks the bell up into himself Guys know that feeling, you know, when it's really cold? You know. Hmm. Okay. Remembrance of Godric the Grafted hone into the Erd Tree. However, its namesake can be unlocked by the Finger Reader. Alternatively, it can be used to gain a great bounty of runes. A few men sought power through the grotesque act of grafting. One day, we'll return together to our home, bathed in rays of gold. Select Remembrance to duplicate. What? So now, I have two of them? Did I not eat his at one point? I think I did. Huh. Unlocked by the finger reader. Now, we were not able to do this at the other turtles. For some reason. But this guy had the bell, so maybe... There was something there. If you guys have ideas of what I should do with that... Uh, let me know. Okay, the only other thing that I can see here... ...are these things off in the distance. Actually, hold up. We didn't go all the way to three. that is but it's dead now oh, these guys yeah these guys could be a problem Is this the right spot? Sure is. Wait, what did it trigger here? Okay, which vein runes? We're gonna let that poison hit, I guess. 
Oh, hold up. Hold up. Maybe not. Are you a person? <laughs> sort of. It will do no good, I swear it. What's that? And yet you persist. You frothing degenerates. She's struggling. Should I kill her? Try attacking. Yeah, that's what I'm wondering. We, like, put her out of her misery? achieves nothing. Sorceress Selen. Okay. Well, Sorceress Selen is gone, and I am not. I consider that to be a win. I'll have to keep that name in, in mind to see if that comes up later. Okay, so now we're going to go to 1 and 2. And then I think we're ready to continue back in Kaled. As much as that pains me to say it. But this little diversion, we did get a bunch of upgrades. We found some interesting weapons that I'm going to look at upgrading. Uh, tiers. I got, I think, one seed. But yeah, overall, pretty solid. And we might even find more. Is this what I marked? <laughs> Looks like it. The mausoleum prowls cradling the soulless demigod. Another one, baby. I'm not a religious man, but God, do I love churches right now. I have any business desecrate. Oh, damn it. That's right. Got you guys are two lifers. Gilded iron shield. Oh, I would love to swap this. It's been a while. Nope. Can't do it. Can't do it. Yeah, for me, at least, the important thing is um, the 100% physical negation. It's never, I mean, it's almost never 100%. But um, 
I'm gonna block, if I'm gonna be carrying this, I need it to not get me killed, you know? Well, I can talk to Melina here. Spoken echoes of Queen Marika linger here as well. Shall I share them with you? In Marika's own words, then, after thy death, I will give back what I once claimed. Return to the lands between. Wage war. And brandish the Elden Ring. Grow strong in the face of death. Warriors of my lord. Lord Godfrey. Hmm. Let's go morning here. I love that those tears, they ne they don't seem to scale. Like the seeds do. that that is a thing why is that why is that there oh there's a stake of america that's interesting huh everyone is screaming Can those, uh, those horse carriers, can they lower us as well? Seems like it. Cool. Demi-human fortress ruins. All right. The monkey clan. What would you guys be hiding here, I wonder? Maybe in here. Horseback battle? Oh boy. Yup. Okay, so clearly we're gonna have a problem here. With all these little monkeys. Demi human queen staff. Probably faith. Yeah. Gift once given to the demi humans to foster peace, it can be wielded even by those of low intelligence, sneered by the fools in the academy. Yeah, I feel like that's a 
personal insult there. But fine. All right. Guys, guess what? It's officially go time. Uh, we're going to head to the Table of Grace. And then we're going to head out to Kaled and get destroyed, probably. Oh, hello. I thank you. So what can I do? Incantations? No. Okay, there's no more of these. They do have some smithing stones. About it, I guess. I asked you not be thankful of it is all the key. He's still in a mood. Fair play. Really just want to talk to our blacksmith anyways, but Thought I would check on people, see how they're doing. Uh, do you have anything to add? Always good to some. Corpse under Stormveil. The misshapen corpse under Stormveil. That is a sacred relic of the Black Knives Plot, as that famed night of assassination is known. It happened during the Golden Age of the Erd Tree, long before the shattering of the Elden Ring. Someone stole a fragment of the Rune of Death from Malaketh, the Black Blade, and on a bitter night, murdered Godwin the Golden. That was the first recorded death of a demigod in all history, and it became the catalyst. Soon, the Elden Ring was smashed, and thus sprang forth the war known as the Shattering. I once wished to become a scholar, you see. I've spent many an hour scouring the archives for knowledge of that fateful plot. The world has grown crooked, and if you intend to put it to rights, you'd better understand what happened to make it this way. Hmm? And that thing is to blame for the shape I'm in now. I urge the utmost caution. Don't disturb the corpse more than necessary. Here's the knife print. Okay, this cool. is a black knife print. I can scarcely believe you managed to get your hands <laughs> on this. You recall our conversation about the Knight of the Black Knives, yes? Yeah, we just had they it. They say the assassins who carried out the deed were scions of the Eternal City. A group entirely of women, arrayed in armor of silver under cloaks which fooled the eye. The knives they wielded, though, were imparted with the power of the Rune of Death through sinister rite. Please, I beg of you, lend me the knife print for a time. Yeah? I'd love nothing more than to tease out its secrets. Maybe that's something though we'll get back from him? A very specific ritual had to be performed to impart the power of the Rune of Death. Traces of the one who performed the rite are sure to remain in the imprint. Half my body has been suffused with death. I'm certain it will help me see. Cool. I mean, we'll just talk to him later, I guess, and see where that leads. Well, I took you for dead. No matter, it's all the same. Lay out your arms, then. Okay. I spoke with the girl. She has a gift for spirit tuning. So I told her everything I know. I'm indebted to a spirit tuner I met long ago. It was all I could do to honor her. I'm sorry I doubted you. Spirit tuning. Okay, so the Uchi. Uh, we need smithing stone fives, which is way... Oh, I thought we would for sure have an upgrade there, but I would have been wrong. Uh, somber smithing stones for this maybe would be okay. And then if we want to... We could go into some of these... Uh, the rapier we could do. We have six of those. It's been our go-to side weapon. This bloodhound fang is really neat. 
Why don't we do this? So now we'll have... We won't use this one. We can use the Rapier for certain things. We can use the Bloodhound's Fang. Uh, we've got the Uchi. Oh yeah, that Flail as well. The Knight Rider Flail we wanted to consider. Okay, let's do this. We gotta eat all of our... All of our runes. Two thousand, and the golden rune ten is five thousand. Okay. Back already. No matter. So this is smithing stone three. This is somber smith. Because so these are using different upgrades. Uh, somber smithing, regular smithing stone threes, and then we've got basic smithing stones here. And then these are sharing now. Smithing stone four. Now we need smithing stone threes. Look at this to ten. That looks good. And really what I need is smithing stone fives. If I want to get the Uchi any higher. But that should be pretty good. Now where is that Roderica? Because she was standing by the fire before. And now she's not. Huh. Not enough. Oh. Good to see you again. Thank you very much. I have you to thank, don't I? For persuading Master Hugh. Yeah, I mean, I basically. I can happily announce that he has taught me the noble toil of spirit tuning. I'm as yet unsure of what I might be able to accomplish. But if I might be able to help you all, I'd certainly like to try. And if there's any chance to ease the suffering of my dear men who were grafted, well, I certainly must try. Roderica, the Spirit Tune Apprentice. Pleased to make your acquaintance. Can we start with what is? There's something you should know. Okay, hold on. Before we ruin this. In this Spirit Tuning menu, you can spend runes and grave glow warts to strengthen the spirits you summon from ashes. What? To strengthen named spirits, you'll need ghost glove warts. Wow. Okay. So we don't have any named one, it looks like. Oh, yeah, we do. Now, okay. These guys are out of my, my spending summon range. But since this one's more expensive... I feel like he's probably better. Does it even say what it's doing? Not really. Not really. So, I'm judging these basically based on their upgrade costs. And that seems to align with their FP costs. broke now I need to warn you about something a little while ago someone started lurking in the wing on the opposite side of the round table and I can hear a 
from all the way over there. What? The howling and wailing of spirits in fear of a curse. I can even hear the repulsive twisted malice in itself. A plethora of spirits in an unceasing cacophony. I can't even imagine. How much suffering inflicted to who knows how many souls. Not even the crafting caused anything like this to happen. You should keep your distance. I know you're strong, <laughs> but please. Huh. I can hear it from a howling and wailing of spirits in fear of the curse. You should keep your. I know you. Opposite of where we are. From across the wing. Yeah. The howl. You should keep your dis. I know you. Sh I feel like I'm really coming to grips with spirit tuning of late. I can see how and why immortal essence exists. A spirit under the golden order. I can understand their yearnings. What they become drawn to. Master Hugh said it himself, actually. That I'm no mere apprentice any longer. <laughs> that was quick. Once again, I'm pleased to make your acquaintance. Roderica, the certified spirit tuner. Congrats on the promotion. Oh, a curtsy. Okay, she just wants to hug. Not interested. So it must be up here. This finger lady, right? Of the tainted by I think we've gone so through this. Grace, the greater we tarnish in the demigods, Kodrick the Glory. Yeah. Okay. See, now this will give us. <laughs> so, for whatever reason, we were able to duplicate this at the. at that land turtle. And if we do this, we can get an axe, which I can't use, or this grafted dragon, which I also cannot use. Um, or I can just consume it. So I'm guessing that's going to be better for us. I'm just not 100% sure why. Why we were able to do that. But it must be... Maybe we, if we find those things, we only attack the ones with bells on them? That could be. Anyways. Time to head to Kaelid. And it's going to be insane. But we've upgraded quite a bit, actually, in the past little while, so... Maybe it won't be that bad. Let's mark out some of the spots. I mean, clearly, we want to go here. Um, there's this. Maybe this. And then this is all just empty and disgusting, it seems like. So, yeah. Wish me luck. Guys, we're going to take a break here when we come back. We die. Lots, probably. See ya.